just woke up. It is, uh, if you can see that, it's 5.12, got up, got up like 10 minutes ago, but I, uh, I'm gonna eat breakfast. Um, I'm not gonna do like a full day of eating or show you exactly what I'm eating just yet, but I am gonna eat breakfast and then we'll be good to go from there. I will show you what I eat for breakfast though because it's actually really good. So occasionally I'll have a white monster when I know I'm just gonna be dead the next day. And like I'm so sore, like chest and shoulder wise, but um, Walden Farms, that's a huge key. Food scale is huge key. So I grab a bowl. Two bowls actually. So first bowl. Take oats. And I do it in grams. So my coach has me doing 56 grams. So I'm gonna measure this guy out to 56 grams, it's a little too much. Put some back. There we go. 56 grams. And then I'll zero that out and then I'll put the second bowl on here. And then I'll grab frozen blueberries. So what I do is I microwave the oatmeal first, and then this stuff. There we go. Grab. I do the oatmeal first, and then after that. I take the blueberries and then I like break those too. And they'll kind of get mushy and soft and a little bit warm. And then I'll put them in with my oatmeal and I'll mix it around so I have a basically a breakfast dessert. Walden Farms is, I mean, there's like nothing in it but 95 milligrams of sodium. There's no carbs, no sugar, nothing. And then oatmeal is just straight great carbs. And then blueberry adds taste and it's good antioxidant and it's fruit and it has good carbs in it too. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and make this and then we're gonna get my day started. I can get ready for work. And then Shelton and I are gonna do some back today at the gym and we'll be recording that. And yesterday's video, I hope you enjoyed that one. It's been a while since I've actually been on YouTube making videos and I'm actually documenting this whole prep. Like I'm literally gonna be doing this like every single day, even if it's like, even if it's like a 30 second update video, I'm gonna be doing something every single day, no matter what. Bam, there was breakfast and I'm gonna mix the blueberries in and it's gonna be delicious. And then I'm gonna prepare my lunch and I'm gonna wait out on the scale. And then I might catch you guys on break. I might show you what I'm eating then possibly, but we'll, we'll see. So my coach told me that I can have one very rare two snacks. So my one snack that I do decide to have usually is in the morning because I eat breakfast and then a few hours go by and I get hungry when I'm working at work and these guys one bars these are a major key it's they taste delicious first of all they have 220 calories they have eight total fat six saturated um, 0.5 poly 1.5 mono has 10 cholesterol, 105 sodium, 24 carb, 10 fiber, one sugar, and then 20 protein. So these things are delicious. I actually have one in my bag that I might use at some point. Um, but then other than that, that's it. I already packed my lunch and I will save that secret stuff for later on and then we'll be good to go from there. So see you at work. 
All right, it's freezing. Welcome to Ohio, where it is a brilliant 28 degrees. And it's freaking freezing. Um, I am about to head to work and we're gonna get this bread. And then after work, I am going to hit back with Shelton. As far as I know, he's still good on for it. But I edited set almost 70 clips last night with the video that you guys just saw hence why it was over 30 minutes long but um yeah it was uh it took me a little while i actually finished it and then i'll actually probably start driving to work um finished it and then after i finished all the clips editing them um the video was rendering out and it was processing and I passed out, like just straight up. Like I didn't even set my alarms or anything like that. It was like, it was like, I don't think it was even 10 o'clock, honestly. I don't even think it was 10 o'clock yet when, when all that happened. So I, I mean, I was so tired because I didn't usually take, I usually take a nap like after work because I get up at, 445 450 every single morning sometimes five if I'm really feeling it um, but yeah it, that's just kind of what happened and um, and then I woke up around two o'clock and I was just like oh shoot I don't have any of my alarms or anything set so I went on my phone and then I I set my alarm thank God I woke up because I was like not sure if I was going to or not, but I'm so glad I did because I would have been screwed for work today. So, but on my way to work and I'll see you guys right after I get done. Someone forgot their prep at home. So I guess this will be my, I guess, snack lunch today. So this, this will count as my snack and then I will have my second meal when I get home and then a smaller pre-workout before the gym. All right, so just got off the phone with Geico and I was actually in a car accident on the way home from the gym. Oh, it's cold, fuck outside. I was on the way home from the gym and some chick pulled out in front of me and then uh, wrecked my Miata. So this is what it looks like. Looks fine, looks fine, then boom. So, front bumper needs to be fixed. The rim, this guy's all smashed in. The door catches on it. Trading paint, all that good stuff. But I don't know if I've actually shown you guys my, my Miata. Maybe I have, maybe I haven't, I don't know. But I don't know if the door's unlocked. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, I hear that? Yeah, it catches. But yeah this is this is a car i got it a couple months ago nice five-speed manual first miata that i actually found that was like manual transmission there's so many of them shockingly like coming in automatic which is crazy because i never thought that you could even get a miata in automatic or at least that year i didn't think you could but i guess you can so but yeah, they, I just got off the phone with them and an inspector or an adjuster is gonna come out and inspect the car at some point for me. Um, maybe Monday, he's gonna give me a call here shortly and that's it. So I'm actually, Shelton's actually coming over early and I'm gonna give this boy a fresh haircut. He probably, probably wants like a fade or something like that done. As far as I know, he hasn't really told me what he wants, but whatever he wants, uh, I got this. For those of you who actually don't know, I actually do cut hair just just for fun and I'm actually really good at it, but it's kind of started into like, yeah, let me mess around and do some simple things and then try scissors and then I end up getting really good with scissors 
and then started working on fades and all that stuff and it came out really nice and a lot of the stuff that I've done so far and I actually want to go and get my license to become a barber so if I can cut hair and train on top of that at the same time best of both worlds right there honestly because I love training and I love cutting hair so I got to find a barber school for that. Uh, there's one actually right next to my work. So I might be able to try and find something to work out with them over there. I'm not sure yet, but that's definitely an option. And that's something that I do. <laughs> and that's something that I do want to do. So um, I'm going to drum for a little bit and then I'll pick up the camera when Shelton gets here. Shelton just got here. Give him a fresh cut. Do a little spin around. Do a little spin around. Yeah. Little fade central. We're gonna head to the gym. We're gonna hit some back. You ready to do this thing? Yes, sir. Let's do it. Let's do it. It's cold. Look at look, look at this dude's wearing. He's wearing like a full <laughs> full like winter jacket, a hat, sweats. Now I'm over here in fucking pineapple shorts and a fortnight long sleeve shirt. Crazy. Rolling up to Metro right now. About to hit some back. It's gonna be a good day. Good lift, good pump. We're gonna record every set, every rep to show you guys exactly what we're doing during this prep and during our workouts. Squeeze it. Supinated, under grip, so flip it around. Yep. Good, come on.
Last set. Come on, six eight. Let's get it. I'm dealing with a, a fucked up core muscle. This dude's dealing with a fucked up back. <laughs> we both got issues, man. Gotta work through it. Absolutely. Ten.
switching angles. Come on. Yep. Six neutral, six pronated. I freaking love this song. Come on. I love this song. No cuts, no cuts. Just straight in. Huh? Straight Let's in. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, love this song. Good.
Good. Squeeze. Come on. Stretch it. Good. What you want to? 170. Hold it back, I was like, what the hell?
25. Let's go. Mom, finish out 95. Come on. There we are. Come on. So 140? Yep, 140. Come on. Squeeze. Hey, there you go. There you go. Hey. 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 One more, one more. Go. About to hit this guy with this guy it's gonna suck but we got 30 minutes oh, it didn't even record already just soaked oh, man we got like seven minutes left and we've been dying since we got to like 10 so this sucks but you gotta do it Grind doesn't stop. Okay. Bam. 30. Oh, five seconds. Oh, 30. Woo. We did it. Man. Matt Menards right now. Just finished that back and cardio workout with Shelton. It went well. We got some food, got some steak and rice and lettuce in us, and it wasn't part of the plan, but we were so hungry, we just had to get something. But I'm um, here visiting my best friend at work. Bring your best friend to work day. That's on Sundays. But yeah, that's, uh, I'm in the Christmas section right now at Menards. So it's, it's really nice. There's a lot of stuff here my my family and I actually got a tree this is the tree that we got it's a nice tree good tree I like it my phone's about to die so I'm gonna end the video here I might watch a movie with my buddy later I'm not sure but I actually have a full jam-packed day so practicing church for drums for tomorrow tomorrow morning then playing two services then going home and practicing again for a evening service at a different church campus connected through the same church um and someone got crunched and that's gonna be my tomorrow so there's gonna be no gym or video for that one so sundays are gonna be 
kind of difficult to do gym videos. That might be the only day I don't don't do a video, like film a video. So there'll be a video every single day, but I won't be filming Sunday or on Sundays. So like, so if I'm like a day ahead in videos or shoot two different videos in one day, I'll have one extra for Sunday, if that makes sense. I think that made sense, it should. I don't know, but I'm gonna end video here and I will see everyone later and hope you enjoyed the workout and there's gonna be more workouts coming. Told you, documenting every step of this prep. Might show you food, I might do a full day of eating, just depends. My nutrition is about to change next month. My coach is gonna update me, so I might do a full day of eating then, but we shall see. Have a good night, stay strong, stay healthy. Let's get these gains together.